I created the heavens and the earth. I took what was formless and empty. I stepped onto the blank canvas of darkness and with four words altered the future of creation itself. Let there be light. From there, the creation story was born. I took what was empty and shapeless and gave it form. As I put pen to creation, it all started to come together. Day and night, sea and sky, I'm the originator of weather. From the ground, I brought vegetation, food for nourishment. My creativity blossomed as I matched seed to tree and tree to seed. Wondrous foods of all kinds came to be. Next came the stars, the moon, and the sun. In unison, we created Father, Spirit, and Son. Four days of creating, but I'm not done yet. Creation is coming together, but something's missing. A new level of creating begins. Living creatures that inhabit the sea and sky I bring to life. Be fruitful and multiply, I say. This, all of this, brings warmth to me. The creative genius within me begins to teem. My head starts to spin. The possibility, the opportunity. Now we can really begin. I step back for a moment to marvel at my canvas. It's all good, I say, and yet the feeling of incomplete still haunts me. I can hardly stand this. We're in unison that something's missing. So I bring forth the deepest part of my creative being and conceive my prized possession. Do you not know? Consider this an honest confession, because that day from the dust of ground, humankind came to pass. Adam and Eve were formed, and now it's very good at last. With my very breath, I breathe life into me. I've never loved anything more. See the nails in my son's hands to prove that that's true. From the very genesis of creation, intimacy and relationship has been what I seek. In the beginning we had it, undivided and unashamed. There was nothing to prove. You could just... Be. This was how I intended it. This is how creation was supposed to be. For a time, the rhythm of life was just right. Day and night, darkness and light. Have you not noticed by now the rhythm hardwired into you? Perhaps it's my secret gift to those who truly know me. Because although I'm all powerful and mighty, I did not create in that vein. In fact, I finished creation with what some would see as a stain. Instead of giving it my all to the very end as you're supposed to do, I decided right there and then to set a new precedent. Rather than setting the tone that you're to run yourself ragged, I finished my masterpiece with something entirely unexpected. See, on the seventh day of creation, I stepped back to marvel at you and at everything else. The intricate details of creation, your fingers and toes, a swordsfish nose, the height and depth of a great oak, a warm ember to keep you warm, and signal locations with smoke, it's all good. But you, you're different. You were created in my image, in my likeness, a chosen people to co-rule and co-reign with me. It's your birthright. It started that night when creation came to be. So now, my child, take up your throne. No matter your mistakes, receive your ring and robe. From the beginning of time, this was my intention. Work, rest, and intimate relationship was my invention. Always and forever, I have pursued you. And so as we continue the story, know that I'm just getting started in what I want to do through you. Hey guys, thanks so much for checking out our YouTube channel. Northview Students is committed to dropping videos weekly that make you laugh and then challenge you in your faith. If you're enjoying this video, click the like button and then make sure you smash the subscribe button so you don't miss any new content. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you later.